guys, welcome back to the Filipino American Vlogs. For today's video, I am going to unbox this DJI Mavic Air 2S. But before we start, please like this video and subscribe to my channel. And if you want to be updated to my channel, please smash that notification bell button for more videos. Let's get started unboxing this DJI Mavic Air 2S. I'm gonna show you around the box, guys, before I'm gonna unbox it. It's sealed by the plastic. So what I'm gonna do, I need a knife to unlock this one. So here's the knife. guys the wrapper right here removed so uh just to let you know guys uh when you open this one there's like two plastic tips right here to strap that this one is completely sealed so we're gonna open this one use a knife but be careful there's one right there we're gonna take the other one right here got it show you guys exactly what's inside in the box for this DJI Mavic Air 2S this one comes with a bag inside of this bag is the actual drone so let's put this right here because we still have the uh, wirings in that one too so to open it there's like right over here the tab zipper so you need to be careful because uh, the drone it's right in that side too so uh, Make sure that when you pull out this drone, don't touch this one right here to grab it. Just touch the whole body to get the drone out. So this is the DJI Mavic Air 2S. I'm going to show you right here. That's the drone. So what we're going to do in here, let's sit this right over here for now. And I'm going to show you exactly what's inside here. Comes with the controller. So let's open this controller also. It's a brand new. It's really nice one to use. So this is the DJI Mavic Air 2S. So uh, this is the joystick right here. So if you are looking where's your joystick, it's right over in the bottom. So you're gonna take this one one by one, and then you're gonna twist it right here. The other one's right over here for the right side joystick you're gonna twist that right over here also so now that you have this already what you're gonna do is like the battery is right over here already so this one right over here I believe this is the extra battery for your drone so show you exactly what's inside this black box this is the cord for the charger right over here uh, let me move right there so that way you guys can see it so uh, it comes with an extra battery there's like one battery right here I believe there is two inside on this one uh, oops there's the charger and then uh, drop something this one is a single charger portion also and then uh, here's the other battery right there so uh, what we're gonna do is put those batteries right here that way you guys can see it and the actual drone also so this is the actual charger i'm gonna show you what's in here that way you guys have an idea what's inside on your once you buy that at dgi mavic or 2s then you have an idea how you're gonna set up your dgi what's inside what you're gonna expect inside the box also so this is the port for the charger so this one has three three port for the batteries I'm gonna show you how these things work so this is your extra battery so this one comes with three battery so I got two extra the other one is right over here I'm gonna show you how this one's to how this one's work and how this one's to set up so this is your battery make sure that it's in the right port so you place one on that 
first port right there then the second one also I'm gonna put the second one in the second port make sure that that one's line up and connected to each other and then the last one is right over in this drum so what we're gonna do we're gonna take this battery out because this one is completely drained so we need to recharge that one so let's take this one slowly right there that's your DJI Mavic R2 S so what we're gonna do there's like a button right here there's a one button right here and there's another button right here you're gonna push this at the same time and then your battery is gonna come out so here's the battery for that drone so I'm gonna show you how this thing set up so let's put that in the third port right there and then your chargers comes with this right over here it's right in this side right here I don't know if you can see it or not but it goes right here the long ones right here the strip so you're gonna put the strip right here also so once that one's plugged in what you're gonna do next is like you're gonna find the cord also so this is the cord for that DJI make sure that you put in the right port so just put it right here and then you're gonna plug in this to your wall outlet and sits like for about like an hour it tells you when it's full because this one is color green and if this one is still like red blinking red this one's still like charging so this one also i'm going to show you what exactly this one is but this one is a charger also it's a single four charger so what you're gonna do is like they put this like because uh you need to charge your controller also because you're gonna lose battery in your controller make sure that you have enough battery before you fly you fly that drone because your controller is that one's gonna hold your drone where you wanna go or where you're gonna how far you're gonna go so you need battery for your uh controller also this is your controller or you can use one of this uh battery to spur your battery and this is the usb also the only thing that this drone you can charge it this one only takes type c uh cable so the type c cable and then goes to the usb right over here so this one's charged right here also but it tells you when this one is full because when you turn in on this one you're gonna push this twice and that one tells you if it's full or not so this is at least like 75 percent of the battery so let me turn it off this one first this one's supposed to turn off by the time you press like two beeps in this thing oh there you go you need to be like a little bit faster by the time you push it so let me plug in this one back here because we need to charge our battery for the drone then i will show you everything here so so let me pull out this box so inside here there is a manual also about how you apply your drone how you're gonna control what do you need to do then how did you how you gonna identify what airspace are you flying also that's very important also because when you fly close to the airport don't go inside to that zone or uh you need to let you need to know first what zone are you in what airspace are you in because once you make mistake that drone right there this drone right there that can land you to jail also this one right here this one is the lenses this can this go to the front of your camera you can tell uh you can do like bb tar or you can make it like color yellow how bright is it i will show you exactly what's inside in this one so this is exactly what's in there there's like four lenses that's different color you can get yellow kind of orange uh blue one bluish color kind of a little bit purple and that one goes right here so take this cover off just make sure that you push this one forward and squeeze a little bit and then slowly slowly take off but since this is brand new there's a sticker right here that holds this drone so we need to take this one out and then squeeze this one to get it out so there you go so this is the cover for that one um 
just to tell you guys, once you're pl done flying your drone, always put this back in there to avoid damage of your on your camera. So this is a gimbal also. So it rotates 360. Drone can fly sideways also. It goes 360 also. Raise up and down. So uh, let's open the other propeller slats. So this is the infrared. This is the one that's very important that this one's not gonna get wet because like this one and the controller synchronize together that way like you have control. So let me put this one down and I will show you how to put this propeller properly. So the drone, let's focus on the drone. So how this thing's gonna work. So the first thing that you have your drone, you unbox your drone, you need to take these rubbers out and this one too. There's like four slots for propeller that you need to take it out. So I'm gonna show you how exactly this works. So this one is a type B propeller. And the other one, we need the type E right here. Let me find if we can find type E. I need two type E and two type B. So this is B and type E. I'm going to show you what's the difference with these two propellers, guys. Because like if you put this in the wrong slot, the drone can't go up. It goes fighting back and forth, so it's staying in the same, the same uh, heights. So the type B and type E. This is the type B, guys. It says like B. I'm gonna show you. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's B, and then the other one is uh, type, type E. So uh, you got E and B. Always remember you have two different propellers in your drone. So how to figure out which lat is going to this type E and type B. So the type B, I'm gonna open this one. So I will show you exactly here. So the type B, if you're facing your drone forward, it's always go to the left side. And it tells you also, there's a diagram also. So let me open first the type E also, that way you can see what's going on in these two different propellers. The two different propel propellers, this is the type B and type E. The type E, there's a circle in the front. I don't know if you see it, but this is the circle right here, the orange circle. So it's easy to figure out also, not because they're all front, they are taking E and B, uh, e, uh, both B's or both A's. It's not like that how it works. It's B and E, E and B. So this is right here. This one right here is a circle orange. I don't know if you can see it, there's a circle orange. This one doesn't have a circle, so that means this is the B propeller, this is the A propeller. So how are you gonna put this thing in here? It's very simple. You just go in this slot right here, let me let me put down the drone that way like we we can push it hard also. So it goes in this slot right here. I'll show you how these things work. You're gonna push this one, this one right here. Just push it right here and slowly twist it. Once you slowly twist it, it goes to the slot. So and you hear a clicks also once it's in the proper slot. So this one is not in the slot yet, so I'm gonna push this in and then it clicks. So it's right over here. Now it's clicked. So we're gonna put the type B propeller. So this is type B. Make sure that you put it properly. Make sure that when you put this one, double check that it's tight enough. Because uh we don't want that thing to be happening that once your drone is already in the air and you lose one of the propeller, then the drone is going to go sideways. So the next thing is like we're going to put the other two. Let's put the trash right here. The other two is going to be, this one is going to be the type E propeller. This is circles and this is a circle also. In this propeller, there's an orange circle right here. I don't know if you can see it, but that's the orange circle. So we're going to put this right over here. Make sure that you hear the click before you release it and make sure this one's dot tight. So inspect your drone before you fly physically. So uh, this is the type B propeller. So I'm gonna open this one like that and then put this right here. Then I will show you exactly how these things work. 
So this is the setup for that drone right there. I took the battery out because I need to charge it. And then the lenses right here, you can take these lenses out also in the gimbal, but make sure you hold this one right here when you take it because we don't want that gimbal to get broken. So uh, let's sit that one right here. I'm gonna close this. Uh, this is the lenses that you can change that one also. Four different lenses. Let's close the one. It comes with this DJI. It's really nice drone. It's expensive, but it's really fun to fly. Right over here, I'm gonna show you also. This is the extra for your uh, joystick to the control. So I'm gonna sit that right there. Then let's go to this joystick. So I'm gonna charge this one later, but I need to unplug this Type C first. That way I can show it to you what's exactly in this thing. So right over here, this one goes to your uh, camera that you can go like down and up for your camera. And this one can go take off and fly. And then the each button, always remember when you have like 20% of battery, don't take a chance to keep on the air. Push this home button and it's go automatically land from where you started. Cause like once you have 20% and you keep like flying in there, you take advantage because oh, it's 20%. Then sometimes that 20%, especially the weather condition, it's cold, it drops the battery quick. So you need to go home before that things happen. Other than that, you're gonna lose your drone or you're gonna hit somebody. You're gonna damage somebody's vehicle or any properties, the house or something like that. Or yeah, you're gonna lose your drone. So make sure when 20% always push this thing to go home like autopilot. So right over here, I'm gonna show you. This one's right here also, this, this thing right here. You can pull this one out. And there's a wire over here if you are using Android or iOS I believe the one that sits up right here is the for the iPhone so the iOS one so this is going to your cell phone so you plug into your cell phone you stick your cell phone right over here and then yeah you can start flying your drone and in case also if that's an iOS the type C one oh no the Android one you can use this one also there's a uh, two extra right here for your different type of the connector connection for your cell phone if you are android this one right here that works one of that thing but if you are apple or iphone this one's works just pull this one out right here and then you can switch this one so since it's in here and my phone is iphone i'm gonna leave it like here i'm gonna push that one right there so uh this is all what you can get from this brand new dji mavic air 2s so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and then if you have more questions, just let me know and then we can go review for this one if you have more questions about how to fly this one. And then uh, you're gonna un download the DJI Fly app also to be able to control this one right here. Read your manual before you fly and then get to know your drone before you fly. Watch more reviews also and then if you have questions also, I can share it to you also what is what I i've done about this drone i can let you know how to fly safe in this dji mavic r2s i hope you guys enjoyed this video and see you to my next vlog thank you